The problem is that it can't go that way, because that's not how the human mind works. You mm. cannot conjure desire simply out of a, uh, out of a sense of obligation. Mm. Now, the other way to comply, of course, would be to suppress your innate aversion and date fat people anyway, because you've been guilted into it. But Great. is that really what she wants? Even if she could berate someone into pretending to be attracted to her, would she want that? How would you feel if, if what if somebody wrote this on a Valentine's card? No, no, no empathy. These radical people, they have no empathy. These radical, these radical people have no empathy. These radical people, these Radical people have no empathy. Well, anyway, because you've been guilted into it. But is that really what she wants? Even if she could berate someone into pretending to be attracted to her, would she want that? How would you feel if, if what if somebody wrote this on a Valentine's card? Roses are red, violets are blue. I'm afraid of being fat phobic, so I'm dating you. It's on a Valentine's card. Roses are these woke uh, body positivity people, bro. The the radical people, not not all, but the radical the radical people. They they only care about they they only care about their happiness. They they only care about their happiness. Crazy. Red violets are crazy. Would she want that? How would you feel if, if what if somebody wrote this on a Valentine's card? Roses are red, violets are blue. I'm afraid of being fat phobic, so I'm dating you. Like if it's not the most romantic sentiment, I would think. Now the truth is that people like Tracy, they really actually do want this kind of compliance. They're not going to get it, but it's what they want. It's no different from the very similar video. It's kind of compliance. They're not going to get it, but this it's what they want. Right it's no simple. different from the very similar videos we've seen from trans influencers giving the same it's kind of compliance. Despicable. It, but it's what they want. It's no different from the very similar videos we've seen from trans influencers giving the same kind of speech to people who aren't attracting trans people. Uh, and in both cases, the people giving the speech would be perfectly happy if you dated them out of a sense of obligation and just pretended to find them attractive. In fact, if anything, they might prefer that. It's just like the LGBT activists who want to force you to bake the cake or respect the pronoun. Yeah. Now, most of us would not want someone to bake us a cake to celebrate some occasion that they personally are deeply opposed to, even if we think they shouldn't be opposed to it. If they are, we wouldn't want to force them to do it. We'd prefer if they didn't. And we wouldn't want someone to pretend to affirm some sort of perception that we have about ourselves if they actually think the perception is false. And we certainly wouldn't want anyone to be romantically involved with us if, in truth, they find us deeply unattractive and viscerally unappealing. We wouldn't want any of them. But the Tracys of the world do want that. And I'm not going to attempt to plunge too deeply into their psyche and analyze their motivations. Maybe they've given up on being truly loved and respected. And, so now they've convinced themselves to prefer the false performance of love and respect. Sad. Um, who knows what's underlying it? Whatever the reason, the point That's is that not good. wielding this kind of moral blackmail against you, wielding it successfully and having you comply, makes them feel power. And they like that feeling. And that's what's going on here. Yeah. E exec execrable stuff. Indubitably execrable stuff. Yeah. Yo. Yo. The the souls you force the souls the souls the souls who you force to be attracted to you won't be truly happy. The the souls who you force to be attracted to you won't be truly happy. It, yeah. It, 
both both parties must be happy not not just one both 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 two parties two parties two parties both parties must be happy not not just one both both parties must be happy not just one